Okay, I think you guys are a little crooked, but we're gonna make it work. Because I just, I had my tripod in my car and I'm like, yes, yes. Was not planning on filming or anything today. So this is a little weird for me. I'm at my mom's house today. I received a package and this is the only reason I'm doing this video. Um, I just want to open it up on camera and get my first impressions. But I did post recently some skates that were my mom's skates and I used to ride those when I was little. My mom got those when she was 13. Um, I'll put up a little picture of her when she was 13 writing them and then I used them when I was a kid probably the same age. I loved it I I you know, I didn't do any cool tricks, but I would just skate around uh, We had like a big cement in the front of our house when I, when I was growing up So I loved to skate. It was so much fun. And I was at my granny's house for her birthday back in June and We were hanging out in her garage. Of course, we were social distancing and I saw the skates and I put them on they still fit me and I started riding them and I was like can I take them home and she's like they're yours like they're just sitting there so I have them they're at my house I wish I would have had them for this video so I could have show, shown you guys them and how torn up they were they were just absolutely done so I recently tried to ride them at my house at my apartment and I couldn't even I couldn't because they were so ruined and so done I definitely want to fix them they are fixable I would think you would just have to put some money into them and I wanted to put some money into some beginner skates that way I can learn cool tricks and looked at reviews and everything and these are they seem like they're gonna be good I want to change out the wheels to outdoor wheels but I'm thinking that these wheels will, will be okay I already know the wheels I want but they are all sold out like everywhere so I don't know everyone's doing skating and I freaking love it and I'm still a beginner like 100% beginner, so. Just open like a normal box, Sandra. I was not expecting them this quickly. Oh my God, guys. Okay, these are the, I knew when I opened the box that they would say, uh, they're sure, they're called Sure Grip Skates. And I did do a little bit of research because I didn't want to spend an arm and a leg on skates as I'm beginning. This is gonna be my new hobby and I want it to be something that like I'm genuine about. And if it is, then of course I'll invest in like three, $400 skates because skates can be really expensive now that I was researching. So these babies I thought were reasonably priced. They were still expensive I feel, but as a beginner, they were like, what are you doing babe? Nice! Look at you! I want to change the wheels to outdoor wheels, but these wheels automatically already seem good. The quality is beautiful. These look really nice. Tighten them or loosen them. But there's like a specific word for it. I'm not sure. I'm a beginner. Don't know. Hey, babe. Well, maybe you need to edit this out because I'm gonna microwave this. Oh, okay. <laughs> what are you microwaving? The caramel. Oh, the caramel? Okay. I gotta go help her. But she's so cute. She, I think I'm gonna have to edit this out. I'm definitely not editing her cute little voice out. Gianna, she wants to do skateboarding. She does want to try this now, she says, after she saw mine. But she's like, she wants to be a skateboarder. And I'm like, cool, I'll be with you <laughs> with these. That's the goal. Um, these wheels seem very decent. The quality is amazing. They said, like the, a lot of the reviews that I read, that the toe stopper is not that great. So that's okay. I wanted a good sturdy boot at least, like a good skate. And then I can add new wheels to it eventually and new toe stoppers. They have black or white and I don't know. I just got white. I know they're going to get dirty, but I just felt like black would be so hot on the feet because this is like leather. I love how these wheels spin so easy though. And I hope they fit. I got a size six. So with the research that I did, you should downsize. But then there's other boots that you should upsize because oh, they fit. Oh, they're perfect. And then I have like room for a sock. The padding in this, I really thought it was gonna be too thick, but it's like perfect. I feel like it's gonna be really comfy and nice. So I'm gonna try these bad boys on. Oh, and it took me a little bit to lace them and I don't even know if I properly lace them. I need to ask a professional. So I'm just putting on my, my sock. 
I think that's so cute. They kind of look like um, like ski boots and they fit perfect. I just need to tie them tighter because then I should have went all the way up. But these are them. Hello. Catch me skating. started unscrewing the bearings and everything on them and I just I got really nervous because I don't want to ruin them I don't want to strip it so I took it over to Skate City thanks to James he was so so sweet and he put on my bearings and my wheels for me Not want to stay at the park i could have stayed at the park all day long it's so beautiful if you haven't gone outside today go outside even if it's for five minutes just take a walk move that energy around it's just nice to get fresh air and to get 